Hello and uh, welcome guys, today we have a little pickup video. So yeah, I went to a convent called Sci-Fi World here in Sweden and yeah, it's always as fun. So let's see, I hope I got all the stuff here right now, so here we go. First of all, I gotta protect my, my Game Boy games here. I got a bunch of these. Sorry, they are official. This camera it is not as good as my my Sony camera, but I forgot to charge that, so sorry about that guys. So yeah. These are real good to have for what I have to show soon. Got a bunch of those. So let, let's show off this little fella first. We got our a little Donatello. Uh, the figure itself, it's not hard to find. But um, you see, he holds his staff, and the staff is always missing. So maybe I'm gonna have a look on my other Donatellos and see if they are in better condition. And just try to carefully switch out the staff, okay? I don't wanna break it. So that was a fun find. Uh, also, I had to pick up some movies, I always do, and I went with these two. Summer, let's see, Summer of uh, 84 and The Town, The Dreaded Sundown. Uh, I enjoyed both of this, I was a little too tired for this actually, but I enjoyed this as well. Sorry for the glare. Um, this one is like, it gives me um, Stranger Things vibes. Yeah, lots of fun, lots of comedy. Mm, not the super duper horror kind of movie, but yeah, it was good anyway. So This is more like your classic Friday 13th slasher, maybe. With some uh, comedy into it, it was pretty funny. I can't believe they cut, cut like two and a half minutes in four scenes in this one and like butchered the movie like that. But. I mean, sure they're gore, but I think this movie was more of a comedy actually. But I enjoyed it, and the cover is just so dope. It just makes me think of uh, Part Two, Jason. Huh? Cool stuff. We made a little deal and got the uh, photo each a little cheaper. Let's see, we can see it here. I went with a Halloween picture here. I think. I think this is from like the third move. No, wait, this is like fourth or fifth. Uh, the pumpkin is opening in the opening. <laughs> and I'm always super nervous when I'm meeting celebrities. Uh, he, he said, don't be. And then we talked a little and yeah, it was a little better. But I went and met Zach Galligan also. He's, he's in this movie uh, Waxwork, but he's most known for being uh, playing Billy in Gremlins. Mm, very awesome. So I stepped up there, a uh, nervous wreck as I am, and got this thing, talked a little about the dinner scene with him, and yeah. Awesome stuff. It, it's a shame you need to pay for the autographs, but still, maybe you just meet this person one time in your life and it's worth it, guys. It's worth it. So let's get, go over to some uh, Game Boy games I got. There were many games that I wanted, but some I skipped. Uh, you have to just stop spending money for after a while. You you no. My, my my wallet's always already hurting, so yeah, let's see. We got we got Mickey Mouse. Mickey Mouse for the Game Boy. The old Game Boy. We got of course we got We got ourselves a, a DuckTales. Woo! -hoo! And next one is not very good, but Toy Story for the Game Boy. <laughs> and last but not least 
it's, it's a little mirror there, I'm sorry. Snow White for the Game Boy Color. Uh, doesn't look like my kind of game actually, but hey, it's Snow White and I'm starting a Disney game collection, so... So those are there. Uh, I can show you here. We have a little cover here thing and it says push on the little thing here. How does this thing? Oh, okay. You push that thing there and hold it to the side. Da -na -na -na. Yeah, and we take um, a duct test. Woohoo! And we put it right in here. Nice and snug. This is how it looks. Safe in a case. I probably need to clean them a little with some alcohol, but they work great. Ah, uh, let's see. Same day we I uh, first thing I did, I found some Disney games for the PlayStation One. So let's see with our Dalmatinos 102 for the PlayStation One. Pretty cheap. It's like five five bucks. And this is not for me, but I thought I had uh, the third person. Bugs Life game, so I thought I add this to the collection. Why not? Five bucks. And I have this on PC, but I don't have an old PC to play it on, so I picked this one up as well. Peter Pan. It's a platformer game where you fly around and collect feathers and stuff. So, five bucks that as well. And then we got another Disney game, of course. Disney's Dinosaurs. I never played this game. Uh, I think we're going to stream this game in the near future, so look out for that if you want to see that. Five bucks, not bad. And the last find of yesterday, and the most expensive one is a complete The Magical Quest, Mickey Mouse. So I've been, I, I'm not usually buying lots of these um, complete games, I mean they're very expensive. They're so nice. This is actually sold in Sweden. It says it says Barry Sala RGB uh, RGB uh, AB <laughs> Barry Sala uh, AB. So this is a Scandinavian release of this game complete. I got it with a little protective case here, so it looks nice and shiny in the shelf. Yeah, not bad. It cost like. Almost a uh, hundred dollars, I think. <laughs> that, that, that's a little too much. I went over my budget slightly. Today we went to a children's uh, uh, children's flea market, I think, and I didn't find really anything super special here. But let's show what I found. I found this. Pimble power. Uh, I'm gonna try it out and see if I like it and if I don't like it At least it's a really nice looking case Good shape. So if I find a game That's a really awesome game. I can switch out this case Spare parts. This is also mostly for the case But hello kitty seasons <laughs> No, what what the heck? Mm, this does not look like a game for me actually, but this is an original Wii case, so same thing again. Spare parts. Spare parts. If we, yes, we have something more. This is like uh, $2 each. And I don't know, I get the feeling these are PlayStation 3 ones. I think so. But two bucks each for PlayStation Move controllers, guys. That is insanely cheap. Okay, I just hope they work. There's no rattling in them, so I hope they're whole and they comes with the straps. And this is a real good find. My friend is just lifted up a hat or something. It's like, hey, look here. And I like, whoa, we're done for PlayStation 3. I need those. So that is uh, this weekend's pickups, guys. Sorry I could not use the good camera, because it is dead now. <laughs> but yeah, guys. Uh, I'm probably going to play some more, more games this week. 
I'm gonna to uh, totally play some more Deadfall Adventures. I need to polish my mouse and keyboard skills. <laughs> so guys, thank you so much for watching this pickup video. And I see you in the next one. Bye! I gotta polish my mouse and keyboard ski. Do 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 do